It may have taken the Swift Current Broncos over a month into the regular season to name a captain, but they found a player who stands out amongst the rest. I was very excited and, and uh, right off the bat I knew it was a huge honour and especially from my team voting for me, it's, uh, it's even more special uh, getting it from them. So I was, I was very honoured and uh, proud just to wear that seat. This is Vaz's fifth season with the Broncos and understands the club's mentality and direction. Well, he's, uh, you know, he's been around here for a long time. He's been here for four years. Um, the direction that we're going with our, with our young group, uh, he's a great, great example for those guys, and, and he's, uh, he's had an excellent start to the season. And the young guys certainly have taken a liking to their new leader. I think he's a really good guy. He's really fun and really out there. Uh, he's good. He uh, uh, makes things easy and comfortable, and uh, he's just a really good guy. He may be an offensive force on the ice, but the humble captain describes his leadership style as a bit more relaxed. Uh, I think just leader by, exam by example. Uh, I think that's a big part of a leader. Um, not, necessarily, not necessarily one of those guys that's going to be uh, too vocal, but uh, just working hard every day and doing the right things uh, most of the time and, and uh, being there for your teammates. I think that's a big part of it too, is just being able to support the younger guys who are coming into the league, maybe uh, not knowing much about the, about the league and getting used to things. So I think that's a big part too. And his teammates seem to agree with his description. Uh, he, he's one of those guys that uh, he, won't, he won't say everything, um, but he'll go out there and show it, and he's always going to put his best foot forward. And, uh, and like I said, that positive attitude that goes a long way in the dressing room. He may be leading the Broncos this season, but Vaz has goals of his own and a dream to make the NHL. Pro is definitely where I want to end up. My dream is to make it to the NHL, and I think every guy playing in this league right now is to move forward from there. And, and uh, if I don't go pro, then school's always a good option. Uh, we've got a great system here with the scholarships and, and the CIS, and, and if pro doesn't work out, I'm, I'm ready to go to school, but uh, I'm definitely making my last, pu last push to play pro over in, the, in Europe or in, in Canada or the States. I don't know where it's gonna take me, but just looking forward to having a good year and, and uh, see what happens. Julie Stewart-Binks, TSN, Swift Current.